Are we self-absorbed? Is it all about us? Have the two become one and you've spent your marriage arguing over which one you became? Is it about you? Because I know in my marriage, it could be about me a lot of times. And whenever it's about me, it's not gonna go well. Marriage is either gonna burn that out of you or you're gonna have a lot of problems in your marriage with self-absorption. One of the two. Marriage is not 50% and 50% coming to make 100%. Marriage is 100% and 100% coming to make a new 100%. And so that's the way it's gotta be. And that's the way you gotta journey through it and to be able to understand that. So self-absorbed. And this woman here is not self-absorbed. You know how we know that? Two things, just there, we can give you 50, but two things that I wanna give you. One, she puts family before herself, right? She's out in the fields. Now we don't know what my brothers were mean to me actually means but she's out in the fields and she's working for the family. So one, family before others. That's gonna have to happen in your marriage, especially when you got some kids that come along. Number two, she's got a great work ethic. She's got a great work ethic. And you know, we see throughout the scriptures, women to just encourage you with great work ethics. Rachel was a shepherdess. Ruth was a gleaner of the fields. Zipporah was a shepherdess. The woman in Proverbs 31, it says that she strengthened her arms. So here's the deal, guys, marry a girl with some grit. Marry a girl with some grit, girl that knows how to work, girl that knows how to serve, girl that knows how to, how to put family first. That's gonna be a blessing. And the same thing, ladies, I could say the same thing for a man. Marry a man with some grit, man that knows how to work, man that knows how to serve, man knows how to put family before himself. And what you do is you end up where now we see, okay, so on the exterior, she's been in the sun. She's not soft-skinned, but she's working from her heart with the self-absorbed out the window and servant-heartedness right there. Hey, thanks for watching. To find out more about Houston's First, you can subscribe to our channel or you can go to houstonsfirst.org.